two minutes or so to go in that third quarter, and you guys went on a 25-4 run leading into the fourth. Like, how big was that in, in closing out a team that was trying to hang around with you guys? Uh, it just shows, you know, growth on our part. Uh, we've been preaching, you know, especially when we're up uh, going into the fourth quarter. Uh, it's an opportunity to show our, our championship uh, habits and, and just being solid, making sure we get stops and offensively making sure that ball move and pop. And um, that unit that came in did an unbelievable job of that. Just just sharing the basketball defensively, being in the right right spots um, at the right times, gang rebounding, and um, offensively sharing the basketball and whoever was open uh, had confidence to knock it down. Um, it's, just, it's a great effort for, for us, especially a bounce back win. We've talked before about LaMarcus and his journey, short-lived last season, retirement, coming back. What can you say but just about how well he's playing and what that, what that does for you? True professional, man, true professional. Uh, you need guys like that, just who's been, a, who's been in the league for a very, very long time, seen it all, uh, basically retired last year and, you know, had the confidence and, and, and the braveness to come back and, and you know, want to be a part of this. So. Um, and he looks great. You know, he looks great. He's, he's doing it all for us um, on both ends of the ball. Obviously, you know, his shot, his shot making ability, but defensively, his communication and his presence out there, um, you know, you can tell the difference. But uh, we're just happy to have him back. When you talk about the bounce back, what does it say that coming off of that terrible fourth quarter in Chicago, you guys scored a season high points and held your opponent to a season low? Um, just uh, I mean, it's, it's going. This is basketball. It's a long season. You know, as much as we try not to have it happen, there's going to be some bad possessions, some bad quarters, some bad games. And the quicker we can, you know, get rid of it and, and bounce back and, and keep pushing, um, the better you know our team will be individually and as a as a collective unit. In Chicago, that quarter was just one of those quarters. First three quarters we played, you know, pretty solid. So we just wanted to come back and get that bad taste out of our mouth and. Uh, perform tonight, and we did an unbelievable job of that. So, uh, get some rest, and we got two more games on this on this six-game road trip. Yeah, I mean he has he has twenty thousand points for a reason. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, so we need him to be himself. We need him to score, and he's he's done that. And we can tell the difference, you know, when he's scoring and, and when he's not involved in the game. And so it's, you know, mostly on me, but our, our team's job to make sure he gets um, touches because, you know, once he gets touches, he obviously he's, he's efficient, but he's a, a very good passer as well. And uh, it just gets, gets our shooter shots. Dang, Dang, you had six assists in the first quarter. I just played the game the right way, man. I just tried to go out there and be aggressive, and guys were open. I tried to push the pace a little bit, you know, feeling good. My my, my, my bounce is a little bit, you know, it's, it's giving back. So I tried to push the pace and, and get in, t in the teeth of the defense and, and get great opportunities for my teammates. And uh, they had two on the ball. I made the right, right play, and, and guys converted. So um, other games it might not be like that. I might be able to score the basketball. So I just read the game and try to play it um, to the best of my ability.